everybody, so um, I posted the video of the Topshop makeup launch and my NYX and MAC haul. Um, I think it was, was it yesterday or the day before? And a lot of you actually wanted me to do the makeup look that I had in the video. Um, the look that I had on my way to London was sort of similar to the look that I had on at home when I was talking about it. Um, so the one I'm doing today is a variation of both because um, people said they wanted a look for the one I wore to London and the, some other people said they wanted a look of what I was actually um, sporting, um, talking about the trip to London, if that makes sense. Um, so yeah, that's what I'm doing today. It's actually a neutral look um, with a twist to it so it's uh, got like an Arabic eyeliner with it um, I quite like this look I've worn it every single day since then believe it or not and um, I'm just going to share with you guys the main products that I used the inner corners I use painterly which is a MAC paint pot and for my crease I use texture which is a corky brown by MAC and then the outer corners I used antique now um, I was swatching and playing around with my um, 120 palette and I found very similar colours in there. This is the 120 palette. Um, some of you guys already know this, but it comes two palettes in it. And then I found some really great dupes for it. So if you don't have these MAC products and you have the 120 palette, don't you worry, you can find something similar to them. Uh, for Painterly, which is this one right here, this is an eyeshadow right here that is very, very similar to Painterly. I don't know if you can see that. And then for um, Antiqued, this one right here is very similar to Antiqued. I don't know if you can tell, but I'll swatch Antiqued as well. Very similar. Look at those two. Very, very similar. And then for um, Texture, this, this is Texture, which is sort of like a matte corky brown. And this one right here is very similar to that of Texture. Um, been on my thumb now so that is that one from the 120 and this is texture right here so hopefully um, you guys can still do the look if you don't have these MAC eyeshadows and if you do happen to have the 120 palette so if you want to see how I did this look just keep on watching okay so I'm going to start off by priming my eyelids using my Too Faced Shadow Insurance all the way to the brow bone in with my MAC paint pot in Painterly and I'm just going to use my fingers for this. It's going to take a bit like that and I'm just going to apply this to the lower lid of my eye lid. <laughs> Tiny bit more. going with a clean 217 and I'm just going to blend painterly out now taking some cello tape I'm just going to take a bit just get rid of the stickiness a bit by just applying it on your hands and then taking it off. And then I'm going to apply this at an angle so that when I put the brown eyeshadow, um, it's going to give like a little line, a cleaner look. So I'm going to go in again, but this time I'm going to take my texture, which is a brownie corky eyeshadow by MAC, and my 224 brush. And I'm just going to dab this on and just apply this to the crease. outer corners I'm taking Antique by MAC and I'm taking my my 217 another 217 and I'm just going to dab that on on its side and I'm going to apply this to the outer corners and then slightly into the crease I'm going to blend it in with circular motions
and then sweep some of it into the crease. Taking the 224, I'm just going to blend everything in so it looks clean. go in with the eyeliner. It's a neutral look so if you want to you can keep it like this and just apply some mascara and go but um, it's a neutral look with a twist today so I'm doing an Arabic um, inspired eyeliner so um, I'm going to take my black eyeliner this is L'Oreal Super Liner and I'm just going to draw a thick black line on my eyelid so starting from the inner corners hope you can see this Grab some more. So I'm just going to take off the tape. I'm going to apply more of the eyeliner to the lower lash line and then connect it to the one on the upper lash line. I've just applied a cold eyeliner to my waterline and my tight line. Um, this one is Rimmel London's Jet Black, but you can use any cold eyeliner that you want to. And now I'm going to apply some mascara, and then um, I'm going to put some false eyelashes on, and I'll be right back. So this is a finished eye look. I'm just going to talk to you quickly about what I have on my face. I have my usual foundation, my powder, and my concealer, you know, the usual stuff. If you haven't seen my foundation tutorial, I do have a foundation tutorial. Um, just check on my channels over there. Um, but on my cheeks today, I'm using Peaches. It's Peaches Blush. It's a blush by MAC. And it's really lovely peach. And, um, yeah, that's what I have on my cheeks. On my lips today, I have a mixture of things. I've got um, Freckle Tone Lipstick, which is a nude love this lipstick and um, over freckle tone I've got in max entice which is a peachy brown um, lip gloss so yeah that's it for the look um, hopefully you enjoyed the tutorial um, any questions just leave them in the comments below don't forget to like this video if you like the look and also for a full list of products just click the link in the info bar to the blog post um, it's going to have every single thing on there. So once again, thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys very soon. Bye.